Okay, now I remember when there was the arcade over here. Hey, the <laughs> <laughs> there used to be an arcade over here, and they had uh, they had Raiden Two right here, and they had some tables, and I remember their soda machine was approximately here. That's after the chicken carcass. Yeah, look, because that's where the that's where the, the actual uh, skeleton eyes remain of a chicken. <laughs> that's random. Um, look at the, they still That's have where the, the cups were, yeah. Yep. So the soda machine was here, I'm good. And yep. I, I specifically remember one day I wanted re uh, refill in my Coke. Uh, so I wrote a sign that said free refills today <laughs> only in management. I stuck it oh on the, I stuck it on the machine. They've actually got the wires that go to the uh, canisters of soda. So yeah, I remember this like it was yesterday, man. I remember this place like it was yesterday. I remember coming here and uh, people would have their, uh, wow, this is absolutely enormous. Wow, this is so much bigger than I remember it being. Is it? This is where they used to have their aisles and uphills. They'd have to showcase VHS's of horror films. It's when I first saw like the acknowledgement of like Friday the 13th series Nightmare on Elm Street series, they had display cases and VHS shells, and we'd look at them, and they'd have a little aisle of the horror movie section and the video boxes, and we were intrigued as kids and bored. And then <laughs> over there was the toy section. My brother and I used to go there and open up the toys, play with them, and then put them back until we were asked by management. It's a form of uh, invasion of security, you know, privacy. <laughs> so... This is absolutely, I had to take my glasses off because my mask was fogging up my glasses and I can't see. Uh, so I've got my phone right in front of my face. So I'm kind of using the phone as my virtual glasses. So even though I can't really see my surroundings, I can see what's on the phone. Let's see if any of these breakers are still labeled. Look at that. Fan, look at this, they're actually still labeled. Men's, women's. These stickers have outlasted pretty much everything. Can't quite make that out. It says uh, snack bar, snack bar sign. Oh, really? Yeah. I wonder if I hit anything, if any of the lights would actually go on. Oh, wow, that's crazy. Might start a fire. Yeah, yeah. Leave on always. Oh, I'm sure I hope they follow. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is really something. I just remember why the birds are dying and exploding, like their carcasses. That yellow one says, leave on something. I can't quite make it out. I'm putting my glasses on. Can't quite make it out, it's too dark. So these drinks are like more updated, so it probably so, had some people in here just goofing around. Yeah. Just being in here is such a treat. Can't quite make those out anymore. Now it used to be back in the day that uh, they would have 
I'm gonna see if Luke remembers this. Hey, Luke. Do you remember, do you remember uh, way back when, when there was a wall, when the actual walls were still up in the back, uh, they had a uh, green banner that went all the way around the top and had like the names of uh, the products they sold. It had like Magnavox and the RCA and stuff. It was a green banner. Remember that? Right along the top. Layaway section was back there. Let's take a, why don't you give me a guide through here? Cause you spent a lot more time here than I did. Yeah. Growing up in the area. By the way, there was a huge bird of unknown origin or species that was left for dead. Well, it actually is dead. <laughs> and it's just left. <laughs> Correctly left for dead. So we're watching where we walk because this is, uh, yeah. Now I do have some memories here. I remember a few things. Clothing. This was the clothing section. Yeah, that's some clothing here. Um, I mean, I could just space it out for you. Um, boy, I, I've dreamed about this place seriously at times. In my dreams, I've come back here a few times, which is kind of weird, but... So, uh, girls, clothes, and men's clothes, and then little boys' clothes, little girls' clothes, um, shoes, I think back there, way away, right there, toy section, all there, and then odds and ends, and sweatshirts and things like that here. And then electronics were a bit here, um, but they also had them over there as well. They moved them when Ames took over. Right. So the, all the stuff for VHS though that I remember as a kid was always advertised right up front there. And that's where I discovered like, you know, the, I'm trying to think like, it would have been 88, Jason Lives and then The Dream master those videos you know it was always like those types of horror films um for some reason the horror films are the one that just stood out probably because they had like a lot of display cases and stuff for that mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but yeah it was a uh, can't remember the last time i was even in here it's been so long when did this close right around 2000 ish mm, maybe a little bit earlier but generally yeah it's incredible but it's incredible i remember approximately in the middle of those uh, two columns that I'm focusing on now, I remember there was like a Ginsu knife demonstration when I was a kid. And I specifically remember wearing my Celebrity Deathmatch shirt. So that place is squarely in 1998. Okay. My mom was watching this demonstration. By the way, that entire snack bar was repurposed. It used to be the other way around, as far as my understanding goes. It was actually at one point facing that way. Really? I only remember it ever being there because I remember playing the arcade cabinets. Yeah, but Hill, Hills, um, when it was Hills, they had it the other way where you get popcorn and slushies and uh, pretzels and No, I was just seeing some graffiti here. Breast cancer awareness, it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this is nuts. Hey, I wonder if there's like a back room or something. Maybe there's well, something back there. back there. Oh, let's check it before we wreck it. Probably should have brought let's a flashlight. Not like a game or something. Oh, no, we'll be okay. I'm down with the clowns. And you gotta see that, oh, glass. Oh, lots of glass. Huh. I don't Keep know if you really need for the man. I don't know if you really need masks in here. You think? Uh, just because of all the crap and stuff in the air and um, dead animals. Mm -hmm. All right, oh, that's fair. Know, I'd, I'd rather not. I could So this is clothing fitting rooms. And These were the fitting rooms back here. Yeah, but right back against the wall. Oh, okay, okay. I don't this know. This is so much bigger than I remembered it being. And then this was where layaway was. Right here? The, they had the office, so I'm Sounds assuming like there's... it kind of went back a little bit. But again, it's hard to say, like, was this, you know, closed off to the public or not? Because there's a door there. Is this a, is this a counter here? Yeah, this is, is this a counter yeah. here? I can't quite tell. Yes, yeah, it is somewhat. 
that's hair of some sort, hopefully not human. Yeah, there's a barrel. Maybe we should like return to the toilets. little beds. Toilets! So oh, this a is bathroom. a bathroom here. I can, I can see it, I can see it. It's film like a movie in here. This is where I highly recommend the wearing of the mask. Yeah, for sure. But this is awesome. Wow. Is it stocked with toilet paper? Did Toby do his job? His <laughs> last day out of the world, just for the future? Well, look at those old school, well, toilet cover things. Just caution. Wow. wow. I don't want to leave the ceiling fell in. But yeah, if you wanted to live in here, you'd have your own mansion. These are urinals here. Probably should have brought a flashlight, but there you go. Yeah. I wonder if the water works or... Hey, but there's still soap in here. Let's see. That's crazy. No, nothing in there still. Are there are the knobs like... Water doesn't work. Yeah. I hear water. Yeah. yeah. I'm glad we came here during the daylight anyway, so we can at least see something. Yeah. I don't know. There's some sort of way you can get the flashlight on your phone to uh, Me? be on. No, yeah, you got a flashlight on your phone, yeah. Uh, I don't. I you don't have any, any light on that? Very minor, but I'll try. Like, I don't know how much. Maybe it'll work. But, see, barely. Okay. All right. So, yeah. Well, I'm going to fix that in there. Wow, so this is like the back area here. There's a stairwell. Are you feeling adventurous? Wow, sure enough. We really need a light for that. Do we, Dave? Yeah, we do. Do we? You stopped us before when we were in that track now. Okay, yeah. The stairs are blocked off. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend. Yeah, that would be ill advised. Yes. Wouldn't recommend that. And then it says emergency exit only. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Boy, this is crazy, man. This is like where Freddy or. I was just thinking that. <laughs> this is his domain. And again, keep in mind that like, the doors have been sealed forever. It's only just until recently that they've actually been opened. People have probably found a way in somehow, but... Well, maybe. life finds a way. Yeah. What does asbestos look like? Pretty great. Oh, look, there's the speaker. speaker. There's the green. There's the green. Out. Yep, that would have been that would have been consistent with the wrap around the top. Very interesting. That would have been where they had the announcements and stuff. Hello, you are trespassing. Violating Penal Code 2.5. And then they have armed security guards like chopping wood. <laughs> Kill lines. There's the other. Oh, sure enough. And then there's another. They probably go all the way down. Oh, look, that's like the, uh, is that the hole there? Yeah, that's like the uh, security, like the two-way mirror hole. Okay. That's what the, there's another one there. Yeah, those are like the two-way mirrors, I think. So this must be definitely like the... Um, that was, uh, that's oh, that's what their stairs were going to come up to. Jewelry. Jewelry yeah. was here. Well, that would make sense that those would be here then. Yeah. The mirrors. Yeah, uh, so that's uh, that's what the upstairs would have gone to was the office or something. But I would not trust the footing up there. Well, if you walk through, you just sue. And then oh, yeah. There's no one to sue. He just gets thrown out, he gets settled. Here's Scrap. The twisted dreams of a thousand workers forced to leave. Did you just kind of crib that from Elm Street? <laughs> uh, HDX bug killer spray. All right, so that's a real game changer. 
I'm generally pretty low tech and I figured out how to get that. All right, that's a game changer right there, my friends. All right, now I say, let's check that out. Uh, up here, what does, it, what does it say? Sales floor, back room floor, sales floor, back room up and down. Let's do it. Oh, what? Did they hear a call? No. Okay. <laughs> you should have brought the cooler. <laughs> yeah. All right, All right now this is this is gold. Now we're talking. Nice and easy, though. Just yeah, this is a concrete floor. We'll be okay. Okay. He said. As he fell through the wood, actually, it is wood. <laughs> well, the years have been kind to this place. Crazy <laughs> things have happened. Dude, this does not feel very secure. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and fluffy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not gonna walk any further. This floor doesn't feel very good. Yeah, I'm gonna go back there. <laughs> <laughs> a little too much creepy. No, wow, it's huge though. It is. And this would have been storage area. All for right. sure. There's a one of those big, is that one of those Resner fans? Oh, oh. Okay. yeah, I'm gonna not right, go right. there. <laughs> At least we got to see it. Yeah. The brand of that fan is not worth my plummeting to my death. So what's this? Panel number seven. Seasonal. Hard war. That's a hard war to fight. All these years it said hard war. I feel like putting that E on just for closure. <laughs> There's a key. So this is a little bit more stone. It doesn't even look like the light on the phone is on. It's so dark in here. You can see where the tile was. You can see this was tile at one point, I think. I don't even remember what the tile and hills look like. Because you moved back in 91 or 90? Uh, I moved back here. I moved here to begin with in 90. Okay. Yeah, I, I never lived here to begin with. So around 88, 89, 90, it probably still would have been the same for the most part. Oh, wow. What's it up? goes up to the ceiling. It goes up to the roof. That's the roof ladder. For like fire escape purposes or whatever. The cellar is the safest place. <laughs> the cellar is a death trap. Wow, this is really something. Can't tell what any of that is. Is it something big? It is, it's a breaker box. Something? Does it please you, my son? So you can probably hear it's raining pretty hard outside. It actually has a nice chill to the atmosphere. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's get a better shot of this bathroom now. Is this the, is this a, no, this is a different bathroom. This might be the ladies. I don't see any urinals. Yeah, you're right. So I wonder if it's functional. Like, would it be ethically uh, immoral if I took a urine <laughs> They actually have to go. Well, if you've got to pee, I'd say it's probably okay to pee. Alright. Unless something grabs me. Like, gooey. It'll get you in the end. Or I get splashed back and then get, like, hepatitis and some sort of viral. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I won't film you doing that. Yeah, kind of close quarters in here. What's that? Close quarters in here. There's three toilets in one stall. Yeah. Well, you know, girls, they like to talk. <laughs> Change maxi pads and secrets.
You're the first person oh, to take a leak in here. You're right. Three yeah. <laughs> first person to take a leak in here in 30 years, probably. Oh, it's the badge of honor, my friend. This is crazy, dude. It is pretty cool. I'm glad we did this together. Like, Yeah, for sure. I'm glad they discovered it was open for one. I don't know how long it's been open this way. But somebody actually broke in. Hey, that benefits us. Yeah, and it is for sale. Look, those are those, uh, oh, never mind. I thought those were like that Pizza Hut style cup up there. Oh, okay. Oh, I remember those. Classic. Hey, let's see if this horn still works. <laughs> what, is, what does it do? Uh, only one way to find out. Horn in what regard? I wouldn't try that. <laughs> you know it was going to. I know you were. All right, so here is this. Yeah, let's check it out. I, want, I wanted to get a better shot of these stairs because okay, before I didn't have any way to do that. Sure, sure. That's now like a big slide. All right, let's check out. Where was it? This door. This is like a zombie bunker, man. I expect roads and the guys to come wheeling in on their little thingamajigs. Golf carts. Golf carts. Wow, what if somebody slammed the door on <laughs> That would be pretty good. Emergency out the station. This must be medical. Oh, check this out. This is where Miguel lowered himself down. That's right. Now I'm feeling Day of the Dead vibes. Yeah, for sure. This is just like Day of the Dead in here. With the white walls and everything. Yeah, it's a little more clean, so I'm going to get out. It's just like... I just don't want it to come down with pneumonia. Oh, no, we'll be fine. Mutant strain of pneumonia. Hey, a little sunshine. So let's check all this out. We came here earlier. I don't know how this uh, video is going to be edited, if at all. But uh, wanted to get some shots of stuff. I don't know, dude. Oh wow, that's probably original product. I get hepatitis from the nails, but that is like that's really cool, man. That's awesome. Now it's like an egg. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we've got old furniture, an old television, pouring water. So it's perfectly safe on electronics. And then we've got these trophies, 94. Really? Does it say Valley Mart? 1996, Tags Men, Buffalo League. That's crazy. That's crazy. Do you want to do them in Mexico or is it coming? Uh, well, we'll discuss that later. Oh, and then we've got the. Uh, Okay. An old exercise bike there. Yeah. Very interesting. Was that the room you were just in? No, that's something else. Look, they painted shrooms on the wall. Uh, <laughs> this is crazy. Wow, this is... Yeah. So... Hmm. Oh boy, who's always got a pinky here? Isn't it interesting though to think that other people were as fascinated by this as we were, as we are. Yeah. You know, over the years and they've come in and they've Probably for the wrong reasons. Yeah, yeah. We're more like nostalgic. Yeah, yeah. We're probably more borderline family. Yeah. That water is like intense, man. Wow. That's like the 36 chamber of shell in there. I'm going to think the original box. Oh, we're, we're fine, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm going to think the original box. I mean, it looks like so dirty. But what better place to be buried than hell? 
Buried under the hills, literally. Have we been down here? I can't remember. We can head out. No, that's fine. Oh, this that. is like mint condition on this wall. Look at that. That's like yeah. That's possibly when when it was Ames, because Ames probably have created a lot of stuff, you know. Ooh. A functional mirror. <laughs> probably the only thing all of it. Yeah, you know, wow, for real. That's nuts. Probably the only thing here that still works. Mm -hmm. This has been a very interesting little adventure. Looks to like. Say uh, the least. This, seriously, this is not. I, I thought it would be more. I, I thought it would be less macabre. Like, it's really like dark. <laughs> yeah. Like it's so ill preserved, it's just degraded and terrible. But. Yeah, they let the whole building go to waste. That's kind of neat. Well, I don't know what it is, but... Forky the Pig and Satan on an LSD trip? <laughs> With Charlie Brown having a Ghostbusters proton pack? <laughs> Maybe I'm the one I'm to think that. <laughs> wow. This has been... Is it old school? What is that? Oh yeah, sure enough. Cool, yeah, yeah, floodlights. Mm -hmm. Now if these drop, they could have kill you, by the way. Oh yeah, that's no problem. There's an emergency eye wash station back there, so we're fine. So open this the is uh, the barrel. It's like a body. This has been the. There's a bird. Former Hills Department Store, which was. When I say more recently in Ames, that's putting it mildly. More recently being 21, 22 years ago, but it closed. Yeah. But uh, a lot of childhood memories here for Luke and a handful for me. Absolutely. This was the first place that I ever discovered about the legendary uh, uh, Crystal Lake Slasher and Freddy Krueger. First time I ever heard about them or saw their films or advertised, at least. My mom used to take us here all the time. A lot of my friends, same deal. They did have great food, but I tell you. I remember the corn dogs being really good here. You know, maybe I'm mistaken though, but I think I remember this being down there at one point, or being here at one point when it was Hills. You know, I think you might be right on that. Because I, I remember when it was Hills, they had a sign that says famous for low prices every day. So they probably expanded with the Ames maybe and just made everything a little bit more embellished. Um, so that bird is very interesting. What breed do you think it is? <laughs> is that a glorified pigeon or some sort of eagle hybrid? Isn't that wacky? That's crazy. All right, well, that's it. Oh, look at the old green sign. I don't think it's that old. It's not quite the... We're just, uh... All right, well, I think it's time to uh, head out of here before we have any inquisitors. But uh, we appreciate your time as we have investigated this once glorious bastion of retail. Till next time, we'll see you later. This has been Dave and Luke from RetroInjection.com.